Hey you! It has been a very long time since I have done a studio vlog. I used to feel like it took way too much time and I was not very good at managing my time, so I would kind of let filming and editing a studio vlog get in the way of all the rest of my work, which is kind of a not the point. But lately I feel like I've actually been managing my time better, I've been editing videos better, so I'm hoping that I can get back into this as a regular thing. We'll see how it goes. And the reason why I am starting this studio vlog right now is because John and I have some very cool news to share, which is that we are going to be adopting a puppy in a few days. Lately, it seems like everyone I know has been getting pregnant. Some of our closest friends here in Champaign are seven, seven and a half months pregnant. Uh, some of our close friends back home in Wichita are getting pregnant, and a ton of the creators that I follow have been announcing pregnancies like crazy lately. So it just feels like it's everywhere. It feels like everyone's getting pregnant. And I've never really been phased by this. I'm 27 years old, and up until now, I've had no interest in having a kid immediately. Like, it's always been one of those in the distant future kind of a deal, but not like now. But something has changed lately, and uh, there has been a very real um, switch for both John and I. Maybe, uh, maybe a baby isn't such a far off thing as we may have thought. So why don't we just start trying to get pregnant, you might ask? Because of one very big thing, which is COVID. <laughs> Neither of us are remotely interested in trying to be pregnant, have a baby, or raise a family in the middle of a pandemic, which has no obvious end to it. So it's definitely not one of those things that's on the top of our list. So what we've decided to do instead to satisfy these parental desires is to get a puppy. Now, if you don't know, we already have a four-year-old dog and a one-and-a-half-year-old, almost two-year-old cat. We already know what dog we're getting. She's getting spayed on the 28th, so we can't take her home until then. So the puppy in question is a Australian cattle dog, Australian shepherd mix. She's this ginger little tiny thing. We don't know exactly how old she is, but she's really young. Her name right now is Peaches, which is cute, but uh, we're definitely going to change it. We like coming up with our own name, so we're still noodling on it. We're probably going to meet her before we decide on a name. Yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll keep you updated on that as we go. Thursday, July 23rd. We just spent the entire morning kind of out running errands and stuff. Uh, we went and got tested for COVID. We just had a baby shower last weekend and we want to make sure that, you know, we're safe and nothing happened. And yesterday I went ahead and took off work time a little bit early and I ran around and did a bit of a shopping spree for photography stuff. So for a long time, for all of my filming and photography stuff, for my, like my, my journals and my art and flat lays and all that stuff, I've had the same handful of, of props for years now. And we're actually wanting to, sometime in the near future, do a big reshoot of old spreads from all of my old bullet journals. So that way everything is up to date, everything is to the same standard of photography. And also because we've sort of changed a lot of our, our ratios and parameters, we tend to take more more tall images now and not wide, and that means that old photos that were taken in those old formats are difficult to use for graphics and stuff today, if that makes sense. So we need to do a big reshoot, and I uh, went ahead and just went out and bought a bunch of stuff that I'm really excited about. Let me show you what I got.
Stop rubbing on the camera, you weirdo. Cora, <laughs> stop. Come here. It is July 28th. Yes, 28th? Yes, and it is like 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, today's the day that we're going to go get the new puppy. We're gonna be leaving at about 4 o'clock. It's about an hour and a half drive. Yeah, we're gonna have her home tonight. We're both really, really excited. Unfortunately, I also have a horrible headache today that uh, has been with me since at least 2 o'clock in the morning when I woke up to take medicine because it was that bad. So that's been bothering me all day. Medication doesn't seem to be doing anything. So I'm just rocking a really shitty headache right now. I spent the morning working and getting some stuff done. I finished editing a video, a cool new speed paint. I actually just uploaded it to my YouTube. And now I think I am going to go lay down for a little bit and close my eyes and try to hope that this headache passes me by so that whenever we go and pick up the puppy, I am not feeling like this anymore. Summer, you're not Summer, you're Cora. What do you want? Uh-huh. Yeah. Cora, what are you being so weird about? You have no idea what's about to hit you. Ready to go, Summer? You ready to go meet your sister? She has no idea what's in the store. Nope. I'm really glad that we're going to be introducing Summer to this puppy in a neutral location because she has no choice but to be excited about it and she won't know what hits her until we're heading home. She's gonna hate us when we take that puppy with us. <laughs> gonna hate us or she's gonna be so excited. There's Summer, very good girl. And uh, here is Basil, asleep on a cup. Couldn't have asked for a better, a better drive home. <laughs> it looks really funny from the front. <laughs> Thank you. 